Continuing on the custom card review streak, we're going to be talking about a STR Super Gogeta re -Easy A, and it's coming in from Zam. Zam sent me five custom cards, but I, I already read the uh, the Baby and Goku Black from a couple days ago, so it's pretty much four. Uh, now, with that out of the way, go ahead and send me custom cards to bhjeffcustomcards at gmail.com so I can review your custom card in the future while I'm getting all these older custom cards out of the way. And if you send me multiple cards like Zam did, I write your name down on a uh, notepad, which I have right in front of me, and I'm going to get to it in a either a live stream or a long video, like how I did for those little two hours of custom cards, little three hours of custom cards. And it's on my custom card review, uh, like, playlist, so... You know, if you guys can go check that out, it's a neat playlist, and I'm pretty sure it's it's not going to be in the link below, but it's going to be at the end of the video. I leave it as like a little uh, note above my head or to the side. Now, uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and just jump straight into it because there's no message in the email. It's just a bunch of custom cards and it says no subject. Thank you, Zam, for sending your custom card or custom cards. Shit. <laughs> now. What do we have here? It is a STR Super Gogeta re A. So his leader skill is all types 3 key and 180% across the board. So of course he gets a higher leader skill. Now this is pretty, it's pretty solid leader skill. This is, this is good. I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> Although it's not a 200% leader skill. I mean, for a re A, this is pretty high. All right. Uh, he also, his, his super attack, of course, is new. His super attack, that being the Soul Punisher, he gets 50% attack for one turn as him stacking defense. Doing immense, of course, and him having a 50% chance to crit and greatly lowering enemy attack and defense. So he greatly lowers attack, has a 50% chance to crit while stacking defense and getting 50% attack for one turn. That is nice. I mean, stacking defense, greatly lowering attack, having a 50% chance to crit as well as getting greatly, uh, him greatly raising attack for one turn, that being him getting 50% attack for one turn. He has a good super attack effect. I mean, or good super attack effects. It's good. <laughs> So, his passive, that being the overwhelming strike, he starts out with 180% attack and defense at the start of turn, and he gets 137% attack and defense when performing a super attack, so that is nice because he's getting an attack defensive buff from his passive to his super attack effect when he performs a super attack. He also gets 20% damage reduction for one turn, which is obviously nice, and he launches a guaranteed super attack when he's facing an extreme class enemy, so course this is like a little hint towards janemba because of course janemba is evil i mean obviously he's a little piece of a villain he also does a guarantee super when he gets five or more key spheres and he also is a rainbow orb changer he's also felt against all types makes sense because it's gogeta and he gets 10 percent attack and defense uh per key sphere obtained as well as eight percent damage reduction. oh excuse me that's not per key sphere obtained he gets 10 percent attack and defense and eight percent damage reduction per rainbow key sphere obtained and he gets 5% damage reduction up to 40% damage reduction with each attack received. So that's about eight attacks, I think. I think so. That's about eight attacks. So he has to take eight attacks to build up all his damage reduction. So after that first turn, he's going to be with up to 40% damage reduction. Let's say he gets back on turn for like turn three. Like you come back to this guy on turn three and he gets all his hits in with him receiving all his hits, of course. He's sitting with. 40% damage reduction. He's also able to do up to how many supers? He can do up to two supers from his passive. One when facing an extreme class enemy, as well as another when he gets five or more keys. So he has basically two guaranteed supers built into him, provided you have those conditions activated, which you want to get those off because he's stacking defense. And to directly support him getting that guaranteed super off with five or more keys is obtained, he is a rainbow orb changer. And another thing to mention is the fact that this guy is a nuker specifically on rainbow key spheres but he's a nuker with uh get him getting 10 percent attack and defense as well as eight percent damage reduction per rainbow key sphere obtained so you get that little golden rotation of like five rainbow key spheres and that's like that's that's how how much damage reduction i can't really do it off the top of my head but <laughs> but yeah um the the case in point is that this guy gets five rainbow keys not five rainbow key spheres because that's not too common but well if you get double orb changers on the rotation than it is i like the fact that he's a unrestricted orb changer by the way yeah so attack defense damage reduction for rainbow keys are obtained obviously nice as well as up to 40 percent damage reduction right over here provided he takes all those attacks immediately and him having two guaranteed supers built into him essentially when he faces extreme class enemy as well as him getting five more keys is obtained is nice and him also getting an attack defensive buff from his passive to a super attack that is good um he's not going to be struggling for key at all considering the fact that he has prepared for battle shocking speed over in the flash fuse fighter he is a unit that has six links yeah he is because he gave him shocking speed for his re easy a yeah i noticed that he doesn't have any starter turn key 
which is okay because he's a rainbow orb changer that's completely fine uh i have no problem with this unit the only thing about this unit um is that he will he will die to a, a boss of super like easily like opening turn he doesn't have all his damage reduction built up and he's not getting uh his his damage reduction for rainbow keys are obtained he can die opening turn i do like the fact that you do get lucky get him like four or five rainbow key spheres and he's gonna be looking pretty damn strong yeah certainly oh i gotta i gotta do the math real quick while we're here <laughs> hold on one second guys one second we're gonna go ahead and go to the calculator so pretty much that's that's eight times five that's 40 wow so you get him five rainbow key spheres that's 40 percent damage reduction that's rare Let's go ahead and go off of like a realistic standpoint of him getting like three Rainbow Key Spheres. So of course, like he'll realistically have up to 24% damage reduction from those Key Spheres. That's still pretty solid considering the fact that he's starting out with that 20% damage reduction for that first turn. So adding that on top of his already 20% damage reduction, he'll have up to 42% uh, attack and defense. Um, now, granted he could die from boss super attack regardless, but... I still think this guy's looking good nonetheless. Also, my my dog just barked like in the background. So I'm sorry about that, guys. So um, with that being said, uh, I appreciate you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. And I love you all. Send me custom cards to bhdevcustomcards.gmail.com. Um, I have to go see if my dog is okay. He's just, he, he barks at like people that are near the door. So <laughs> I love you guys and peace.